shouldn't be undervalued. Senator Pocock. Thank you, Acting Deputy President. The ACD is full of innovative small businesses. Over the past few months, my team and I have visited dozens of small business owners, entrepreneurs and passionate advocates for innovation in Canberra. I want to share some of their stories as I believe their names should be known to the legislators in this place. Flint Pro provide carbon estimates for land used at highly var variable temporospatial scales. Wildlife drones, whose drones can track more frequencies simultaneously than anybody else in the market. Geospatial intelligence, whose patented technology, Mercury, can do things in the geolocation and intelligence space that I didn't know were possible until they showed me. Majura Valley Free Range Eggs, who are proud to boast the oldest occupied house and the oldest operating farm in the ACT. Aurobox, whose world-leading software allows for the seamless sharing of medical imaging between doctors and patients. CDFS, who started out as a small IT house and have since grown to become Australia's leading supplier of digital, digital forensic tools and training. GoTerra, whose insect-based waste management system turns waste into fertiliser. Wing, who chose to base their world-first drone delivery service in Canberra and specifically uh, chose it to work with the regulators here. And Pen10, whose world-class cyber defence and security products were first being used by governments in the UK before they managed to win an Australian government contract, despite being founded here in Canberra. I could go on. I've only got two minutes. I'm proud to represent an electorate with so many smart, forward-thinking people working to make Canberra a world-leading innovation hub. Senator Rustin. Thank you. 